Today we are doing the Get Bench 13 workout, which is a workout to show you that you don't necessarily need to buy a lot of equipment and you don't need to have a gym membership to get a good workout. So find things around where you live or your house and use them. If you don't have a park where you can't find a bench, you can always use a stair, your front step, your back step, the stairs up or down in your house. Just make sure that it's something stable that you can stand and or jump on and it's not gonna fall over. So the first thing we need to do today is go do our warm up. So we start with our moving breathing. Inhale, exhale. Get prepared, set your intention for today. What do we wanna do? How many reps we're gonna do? And we're gonna start into some nice body weight squats. Just working those joints out, getting them all nice and lubricated, nice and warmed up, ready to go. We got a lot of legs today. We've got some abs and some arms as well. So we're making sure that all of those big muscle groups and those joints are nice and warm. Good. We go to some arm circles. Go forward. And then also really concentrate on your breathing today. We're doing a lot of intensity stuff. We do a lot of things where you are going to be heavy breathing. So we're really focused on keeping that slow, controlled breath. That's the key. Okay, we're going to go reverse backwards. And then each workout today is for one minute. So we're doing a one minute interval. Good, shake out those arms. One minute interval is for 15 seconds. Okay, so make sure that you have that interval timer set. One minute for each exercise and then 15 seconds in between. During those 15 seconds, that's your chance to breathe, but it's my chance to explain the next workout. So make sure that you're still listening and focusing on lowering that breathing. So the first exercise that we're going to do is a right leg step up with a left leg kickback. So I'm making sure my right leg is completely on the bench. I'm gonna push through my heel, step up and kick back. Making sure that that left leg, that left foot is flexed and I'm leading with the heel so I get a little booty pop in there. Nice lift with that booty. Okay, it's just gonna be continuous, step up and down. All right, ready, set, go. Focus on that breathing. Four type. Good. Keep going. If you need to stop and slow down, feel free to do so and then jump back into it. Three, two, one, boom. That leg should be on fire. I know mine is. Okay, the next exercise, we are going to do the same thing. Opposite leg, left leg step up, right leg kick back. Get set, my foot's on the bench, go. Good job. All right, the next one that we're going to do are bench hops or box hops. You're going to be jumping from the ground to the top of the box or the bench. If you cannot do that, modified, turn around. We're going to do sit down squats, but if this is too easy for you, turn and get started. Thank you. 
Three, two, one. All right, good job. Next thing we are going to do is toe taps. Very similar to high knees. You're going to be tapping your toe against the bench. This is your modification. You need to go slow, go slow. If not, go in fast. Again, if you need to slow down, you need to catch your breath. Like myself, slow down, tap those toes. And then once you catch that breath, get back into it. Focus on that slow, controlled breathing. As you can see, I'm already a little winded. You're probably winded as well. So focus, get control, and then jump back into it. Good job. Focus on that breathing. Get it back down. All right, the next thing we're gonna do are push-ups. They're incline push-ups. So my hands are on the bench. My feet are back. And I'm just going down and up. All right. There's no modification for this. So do as many as you can. You can go slow or you can go fast. Make it work for you. harder my legs are straight and I'm out if you need a modification bend those legs and bring them a little closer to you my palms are behind me fingers are facing towards my toes again modification my knees are bent and close if you want to make it harder legs are straight and out it's up to you if you're too tired right now go with the modification but if you want more get those legs out and get going I'm gonna go with the modification so I can save myself for the rest of the video Just hit halfway. If your arms are dying, take a break and then jump back in. Good job, we have nine seconds left. Keep going. Three, two, one. Good job. All right, the next thing we're going to do are mountain climbers. So turn, hands on the bench. These are driving forward. You need to go slow, go slow. If not, go fast. You can really get that butt pumping. Focus on that breathing. Abs tight.
Ten seconds. Time. Good job. All right. Last arm one before we get back into some legs. We're going to do a straight plank with shoulder taps. If you need a modification, go to your knee. If you don't, we're up and we're tapping. Ab side. Your arms should be on fire. modification drop to your knees and keep going if you're ready to go the whole way hop back up it's your workout make it work for you 10 seconds three two one time good job all right the next exercise that we're going to do we are going to do a side step, side crunch. So, my foot's on the bench, I'm up, and I'm crunching. Ready, go. Good. Take it slow, get that breathing back. Focus on that balance. Might be a little tipsy or shaky right now. I know I am. You get picked the highest bench in the park. Good. 15 seconds. Keep going. Five, four, three, two, one. All right, next exercise, opposite side. I'm gonna have my back to the camera, but it's right leg up, left leg side crunch. Starting in three, two, one. Good job. We have 20 seconds. Three, two, one. Whew, handle a little early. As you can see, I'm pretty winded. You should be too. So focus on that breathing. The next one we're going to do is split leg squat. One toes on the bench, my left foot, my right leg's on the ground. I'm squatting down and coming back up. Making sure that knee is behind the toe. For any reason, your knee starts going over your toe, jump out a little more and keep going. So slow and steady, getting that breathing back. job. Remember, if you need to take a break, take a break, jump back into it. 15 seconds. We're almost done. 
Keep going. Got three more exercises. Two more exercises. Time. All right, next exercise. Same thing, opposite leg. So, left leg's on the ground, right leg's up. Three, two, go. Good job. Focus on that breathing. Fourteen seconds. You wanna dance? Let's go. You wanna rock? Let's go. You wanna dance? Three, two, one. All right, last exercise. We hit the ground running. We're doing jumping jacks. Ending with a bang. If for any reason you have shoulder problems, you want your arms to go straight up. If not, we're going out. Go. On your toes, soft toes, soft knees, abs tight. Focus, you're halfway. Ten seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. You are done. Good job. Now we are going to start the cool down once you get that breathing back. So walk around, take a breath, push pause, get that breathing back, and come back for the cool down. Congratulations, you just finished the Get Bench 13 workout. We're losing light out here in the park, so I'm gonna do a nice, quick cool down. But if you feel like you need more, rewind and do it again. So the first thing we're gonna do is we're just gonna start with that moving breathing that we always do for warm up and cool down. Make sure you got that breath back. So, breathe in, exhale down. Breathe in, exhale down, one more time. Exhale down. Good, okay, so I'm gonna use the bench for some of our stretches today. So foot up, lean down, try to touch those toes, really getting a nice hamstring stretch. We did a lot of legs today. These should be shaky. So make sure that we get nice, good stretches all over those legs. Good, and then we're gonna switch. Right leg up, try to touch that toe. Good job. I like to hold stretches for about 10 seconds. If you need a little bit more, feel free to hold them longer. Or rewind it again. All right, the next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna do a nice quad stretch. So, standing on my left leg, I'm gonna grab my toe, pull towards my booty. Make sure we're not pulling towards that hip. We don't want any strain on the outside of that knee, focusing on that balance. As you can see, I'm still trying to get my breath back. So focusing on Nice, slow breaths. So again, make sure that knee is behind you, not out to the side. We're gonna switch legs. Woo! Balance is shaky. <laughs> Good job. And I'm gonna use the bench to do a nice calf stretch. So pushing my heel back towards the ground. You can do both at the same time if you want, or one at a time, it's up to you. Really push through. 
Put your legs. Which is then going to bring me into my hip flexor stretch. So really pushing this leg back leg down into the ground. Getting a nice stretch right in that hip flexor. And then I'm going to switch. Good job. I'm going to do a nice arm stretch. Pull it towards you. Make sure we stretch out those shoulders. Did a lot of push-ups and planks today. Mostly shoulders, so make sure you stretch those out. Switch. All right, shake it out. Congratulations. Thank you for joining me in the Get Benched 13 workouts, and thanks for watching. Hope you guys have a great rest of your week. Bye.